Our next guest is a rising star at just 13 years old, Dylan Gilmer. Also known as Young Dylan, first stole our hearts as one of Ellen DeGeneres' favorite kids back in 2016. Now he stars in his own Nickelodeon show, Tyler Perry's Young Dylan. It's all about a family whose world is turned upside down when their nephew, a hip hop mogul in training, moves in unannounced. Take a look. You should talk about this mixer for a while now. When can we, uh, I don't know, finally listen to it? As soon as it's finished. You can download it like everyone else. Can you at least tell us what the name of the mixtape is? I still need to figure that out. <laughs> you can always go with the title I came up with. <clears throat> Mary Mix Boss! No, never. And please stop texting me that before I block you. <laughs> block you. And on Christmas Day, Dylan and I will team up for a slime covered football game between the Denver Broncos and Los Angeles Rams on Nickelodeon. I'll be calling the game while Dylan will be working it as well. Like CBS, Nickelodeon is a division of Paramount Global. Dylan Gilmer, what's up, young Dylan YD? What's up, baby? How you doing? Yay! <laughs> <laughs> All right, so listen, we've been working slime time. We've also been doing the Nickelodeon games. What are you looking forward to this year? I'm looking forward to meeting some new players I never met before. And I'm also looking forward to talk to you guys, of course, you know, reporting what's going on in the field. And I'm also looking forward to, you know, Christmas. You know, the vibes are going to be cool. It's a regular season game. And, you know, we're going to be having virtual effects. You're going to see Patrick Starr. It's going to be amazing. I cannot wait. Yeah, no doubt. You mentioned the vibes. And like you always say, you know the vibes. So as people you know are getting vibes. ready for... <laughs> there you go. <laughs> How do you prepare for a game like this? Because it's a little bit different, right? We're on calls, on Zooms, talking to players. People think we're asking X's and O's. But tell the fans how you prepare for a game like this. How I prepare for a game like this, so this is my year or two on the sideline. So I really just channel my energy and I get all my energy from the crowd, you know. I really feel how the crowd is feeling, to be honest with you. And I feel like that helps me out a lot because the crowd is always lit and it's always loud in the stadium. <laughs> and I also channel my energy from you guys. If you guys are showing good vibes, I'm here for it and it's amazing. Uh, Dylan, we like good vibes, so how about this? Get Liddy, get Liddy. Your boy got a key to the city. Hey. You recognize that? Yes, yes, get Liddy. Dad, that song is coming out in January, but my new song came out to drop also. Thank you. I know. I was looking at your video, and I said, God, I was thinking, Dylan, is there anything you can't do? I remember that moment on Ellen's show when Tyler came out and surprised you and said you're going to have a show of your own. I'm trying to think, so when you look at your future, what is exactly you want to do? You seem to be living your dream right now. Uh, yes, ma'am. It's, it's just truly a blessing that I'm here right now, and it's truly an honor to work with these amazing people that I'm working with. And my future is definitely looking bright, and I have way more to come. You know, I want to do, I have movies, shows, more shows, and hopefully, so, you know, me and Nate got nominated for Slime Time for an Emmy Award, so, you know, hopefully more awards. And I also yeah. just want to start a business and also just help that. my family out and, like, be successful. I love this. I love you said me and Nate got a thing. So you've worked with Nate. You're working with Jermaine Dupri, another legendary mogul. Mm -hmm. Tyler Perry, certainly another legendary mogul. What do you learn from all of these greats? Nate, Tyler, <laughs> Jermaine. Oh, that's a great question because these are a lot of legendary people. And, you yeah. know, what I learned is just to, you know, Never give up. Always be yourself because if you're not being yourself, you're basically not in, in a comfortable position if you're not yourself. And you also just got to work hard and have a great supportive system around you, people you trust around you. Nate, yep. ask him the question you ask him about girls because I know, Dylan, the girls are coming after you. I know it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Dylan, you always say, you know, girls, girls, you get no girls. Or you say that you get a lot of girls. But I always tell you what's better than having a lot of girls is what? One girl, one girl only. <laughs> There you that go. is right. A good one. One good girl. One good one. One good, one. good, one. good girl. Listen, uh, yes, Dylan, one good it's David. One. one good one. Yes. 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 I don't, I don't I... want to put you on the spot on national television. You know, it's, it's not the, the best thing to do, but you are known for rapping on the spot. So, wow. I mean, what can you give us, man? I can give you a few bars. I can give you a few bars. All right. All right. All right. Look. 
That boy fly, no Peter Pan. I got a big bag and a trip plan. Big waving on big bands. Got me leaning back like a kickstand. All Nick balling, not a Knicks fan. Ambient decks, I can switch hands. Range over to the Lambo. Got me sinking lower than quicksand. Who wanna put money up at it? Her money gonna come, I'm ready. My dogs ain't never been petty. Won't do low cake, that's Debbie. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah YB. All right, yeah. man. That's what I'm talking about, AYD, <laughs> man. You know I'm proud of you, like I always yeah. tell you. Thank you for joining us, and I'll see you soon. The Nickelodeon NFL Nickmas game between the Rams, Broncos, will air on Nickelodeon alongside CBS Sports coverage of the game here on CBS and streaming on NFL+. YD can do it all. That's my guy. He really can. We will be right back. <laughs> 